Max Force fly spot bait and Max Force granular fly bait are formulated around a house fly's biological needs and behaviors. So understanding basic house fly biology will benefit your fly management strategies. The common house fly causes a number of problems. Stress and distraction to humans and animals. Spreading disease. Large populations can migrate, causing potential problems with neighbors. They soil surfaces with fly dirt and portray a dirty or unhealthy image. Houseflies are common all over the world. The adult housefly is a drab, gray-colored insect slightly longer than a quarter of an inch. Distinguishing markings on the housefly are four narrow black stripes on the top of the thorax and a sharp angled bend in the fourth wing vein. Its face has two velvety stripes which are silver above and gold below. Females lay eggs in decaying organic matter, producing up to 1,000 eggs in their lifetime. Under suitable conditions, eggs hatch in less than 24 hours into the cream-colored larvae we know as maggots that burrow into the food material on which they hatched. After developing, maggots leave the decaying material and seek out dry, sheltered areas to pupate. When fully formed, the adult fly breaks open the end of the pupal case and emerges. The adult flies will live one to one and a half months. During suitable conditions, two or more generations may be completed in a month and populations peak in late summer or early autumn. Houseflies have sponging, sucking mouth parts, which enable them to ingest only liquid materials, so they cannot bite or chew solid foods. Houseflies can also taste with their feet, so when they land on something, they know right away if the surface is food that they want to consume. Like all insects, houseflies are cold-blooded. That's why you'll see them resting in patches of indoor sunlight on floors, walls, and ceilings early in the day. Outdoors, they prefer to rest in warm, sunny areas without too much air movement. You'll find them resting on plants, garbage cans, and other similar surfaces. Houseflies prefer to land on corners and edges, and thin objects such as wires and strings. Now that you know more about housefly biology, you can understand how a resource site like this compactor contributes to fly population problems around your accounts. For more information, visit epestsupply.com.